Americans who are against the Biden student loan forgiveness, why? I don't disagree with it per se, but without setting up systems to keep school costs in check, we will get this crisis to reoccur every few years as college costs keep skyrocketing. Before federal student loans were guaranteed, college was nowhere near this expensive. I'm against it as a solution, because schools will still charge $100,000 YR and lenders will still keep making ridiculous loans. Band aid solution, while better than nothing, does not solve any of the root causes of the crisis, which is the unchecked guaranteed loaning practice paired with sizable interest rates. Loan forgiveness doesn't make sense unless you also stop giving out the loans. Universities were able to increase their tuition so much because everyone was getting guaranteed student loans. And now you're putting down precedent that the loans can be forgiven, does that sound wise to you? I only disagree with it because it doesn't address the fundamental problem with these loans, which is the predatory interest rates that make them damn near impossible to pay off. The government should be regulating those rates so students aren't being gouged and can actually pay the loans off with reasonable interest. Edit just want to clarify, I'm pro-loan relief, I just wish more was being done to address the core issue with these loans. But I would rather the government do something instead of continuing to do nothing. I think cutting the interest to one makes more sense. If the actual student loan program were re-evaluated loan forgiveness wouldn't be an issue. I don't think it addresses any long-term issues, just symptoms. I also think it's literally just to gain midterm support. Because it won't change the for more profit mindset of the college system at all, and will maybe even make it worse in the very near future. Yes, it'll help tons of people now, but next week? Next year? Problem not solved. The government being a guarantor of student loans means that this debt falls on the taxpayer. The move to privatize education through loans is essentially another tax dodge of the baby boomers that own a large portion of the wealth in this country and now as a group represent an investor class who vote against anything that benefits those who work. We need government out of loans and watch college prices drop immediately. Because it doesn't address the primary issue that it claims to address, and there are way better options to address said issue. It's primarily a political bluff to win over young and emotional voters by insinuating there's a $10,000 check waiting for them if they vote Democrat in the next election. If you want economic relief, tax the rich more, tax corporations fairly, and regulate the health care industry to reduce prices. Any one of these three options have a higher ROI for the average student, let alone average American. To me this is about decision ownership. If you made a bad decision, why shouldn't you own the consequences? I'm fine with the interest being forgiven, or a good portion of it. But you weren't forced to take out the loans, that was a choice. You are responsible for your choices and debts, not the taxpayer. The real issue is let's make education more affordable. It does precisely fuck all to fix the original problem of needing to go into debt to go to college. Or the amount of debt that is required. It also mostly benefits upper middle class people at the expense of poor people who didn't have college as an option. 1. It transfers the cost from the people who took out the loans to taxpayers, who didn't. 2. It creates an expectation that this will occur for every new group of students. 3. It disincentivizes schools to reduce costs. A better option would have been to require schools to provide refunds, and to penalize schools for increasing costs. An even better solution would be to allow students to discharge the debt through bankruptcy. That would end the whole student loan fiasco once and for all. Edit added second solution. People shouldn't pay off debt that isn't theirs. College graduates on average earn much more over the course of a lifetime than high school graduates. Why should high school graduate taxpayers subsidize those who will be better off than they are? Poor people shouldn't have to pay richer people's loans. Paying the student loans means universities will continue to overcharge. I didn't sign your loan agreement you did. Because I decided which university to attend and how much I worked during and where because of their tuition reimbursement based solely off cost of attendance. I know many people who took out loans for housing living expenses and lived it up in college not giving AF. 
Some now have fancier university names in their degrees and if their debt is wiped out, they don't have to be held accountable for the consequences of their decisions. I agree with what is being said by basically everyone on here. The only way I would see student loan forgiveness as a viable option is if it's the first step in a wider plan to deal with the student debt crisis. In other words, if debt is the symptom, cure both the cause and the symptoms. Otherwise, it just won't work. Most people on IBR will make very small payments for 25 years and then have them forgiven. Think about how big those balances will grow over 25 years. The taxpayers of tomorrow get to deal with that nightmare. The other part is the day those loans are charged off, their balances are considered taxable income. These are the twin towers created by current policies. It doesn't fix the issue causing it and just makes taxpayers foot the bill as usual. I'm against it because you invested in yourself, not me. Cancel all of the interest but not the principal. I busted my ass to pay my way through school. The least people could do is pay for what they used. Class warfare. Except only one side is fighting, and they are doing really, really well. They even brainwash the people they are fighting to shoot themselves in the head. Education should be free. Education is twisted these days. It's about training kids to become the next line of workers. Because it's a drop in the bucket to temporarily appease us so we don't look into the deeper issues. It's a band-aid. It's a distraction. Honestly, it is offensive to my intelligence. Because it's not fair to young people who don't go to school and say, get a loan to start a small business. They still have to pay it back, and will most likely end up earning far less than a graduate. The problems are the schools which charge too much. As long the state doesn't regulate them, every forgiveness is just a bonus paid to THID schools with tax money. I could not afford to go, clearly they could not either. I'm okay with loan forgiveness, but just like anything else, the degree should be revoked too. Fair is fair. OIDK. Maybe because I'm going to be paying for it and not benefiting from it since I didn't go to college. Because it's insane. You willingly take a loan you need to pay it back. Everyone else had to. Because it doesn't fix the underlying problem, we'll just end up in the same spot down the road due to colleges being able to hack up school loans. It's also some personal accountability, degree earning potential is out there, yet some students choose to rack up huge debt getting degrees with low earning potential giving them a pass hinders them from the learning the consequences of their actions. It's also a slap in the face to those who worked, saved, and paid off their debt. Well since you are asking. Why should I teach you a highly technical very difficult skill for free? I have no problem teaching you but my time and experience deserve to be rewarded especially if you benefit monetarily. That is why I am against it. When you borrow money from your fellow citizens through the student loan program, we expect you to pay it back. Then we can lend it to the people following you for their educations. It's a simple way to keep our people educated but borrowers must repay for the future of others. I'm against the whole Biden administration. Our country is under attack and they support Ukraine more than its people. Because your debt was your choice. Welcome to adulthood. It's not the government's role to pay your debts with our money they took from us through taxes. I'm against it because I don't want tax money spent to pay for someone's dance theory degree now that they can't find a job. I'm thinking of a person I know, specifically. 130k in debt for a dance degree. She works at Barnes and Noble. Taxes. The decline of personal responsibility. The inevitable increase of college prices when they learn the government basically guarantees them more money. I think the better solution would just be to get rid of interest on the loans. I do have student loans that I am currently taking out but the interest is more of a problem. What about all the people that had to pay? What happens if they decide they want their money back you gotta pay back on your taxes I could see this happening why should people pay for other people's schooling why should I pay my house payment why should I pay my car payment you choose to get 100k in debt why does anybody get a handout? 